Hey, Booski. It's me. Um, I'm doing this a little early because I'm so behind on videos. It's really shameful. I just really let this month get away from me. Uh, between work and everything with the new dog and mostly work and mostly work because God forbid I actually put any effort into my law school applications. Um, I've just been, I come home tired. I wake up tired. Speaking of that, <laughs> when he, when I read the title for your last video, I fell asleep like this. It reminded me of uh, Flawless by Beyonce and Nicki Minaj. I woke up like this, except it was I fell asleep like this. <clears throat> anyway, I'm glad that you're done with all your tests. I, too, am done with all my tests. Also, can I just say, so not to be a complaining person, but my mind is boggled at your GRE prep. I understand that the GRE is a little more basic skills than the LSAT, but I'm seriously just sitting, as you, as you were telling me what you were going to do, I was sitting here like, what? No. <laughs> it's just, I'm going to take a practice test. I'm going to make some flashcards. I'm like, <sighs> with the LSAT, you can make flashcards all you want. I feel like it's not actually a useful study aid because you're going to be effed on the LSAT no matter what. It's just, so my mind was boggled. I'm just, it was emotionally, the whole LSAT process was emotionally scarring for me. And I think that's part of the reason <laughs> why I'm like, anyway. Um, also, I'm hearing you about the French press. I love, I loved my French press when I first got it and I, you know, got a French press a really long time ago, and it got went bad because I thought it was... It's a very long story, and it's very gross and graphic. But I have a new one that I haven't used since the first time I got it. I got it, like, uh, two Christmases ago, so it's been a long time since I've used it. But I remember one semester, 2011, my coffee maker broke, so I was just using the French press. And the French press is wonderful. Do not get me wrong. But, after about two months of French press coffee, all I wanted was a hot, steaming hot, piping hot, center of the sun, steaming hot cup of coffee. And that is just something that you cannot get with the French press. Because it is amazing, wonderful, but regardless, you have to let it sit. And thus, it will not be center of the sun hot. And that is what I wanted. So th at that point, that was when I started going to Expresso Royale and spending all my money on not that great, but not bad coffee. Which, <sighs> but yeah, I, I do, I have my French press. I still love it. I don't use it very often because it's very easy to forget that you are French pressing coffee and the lighting just changed really dramatically. Um, and it'll just get cold. <laughs> I tried the cold press it but it didn't work out very well it's it you had to leave it in a lot longer than you would think um yeah that's all I wrote down as far as uh oh make sure you say this look at my hair I got it it's really it's curled right now and I don't know why because I made sure I didn't whatever um I got my hair done on Friday by my friend my sheep stealer Lauren Bell you may know her so I got my hair done by her, and it was very nice, like a pinup, and I had this back, and it was with the clip, and it was all straight, and it had curls at the ends. Right now it has curls at the end, but not the curls that she put in there. So it's starting to, I don't know how this happened, because it my hair did not get wet. My hair did not get wet, and it's just going back to its normal curl, slowly but surely, and I hate it. But what are you going to do? That's kind of how it works in this, in this curly-haired world. Um, I don't really have too much to say, you know, I'm still trying to find the motivation to apply to law schools. It's very hard. The hardest part about the whole thing is actually just asking for letters of recommendation, which I feel like it shouldn't be that hard. I only need two. One of them is from the pastor. It's really not that hard. So I need to get over it. Um, anyway, I'm at the end of my time. I hope you have a good week. I will be back tomorrow to catch up on my videos. So, goodbye for now.